So somewhat of an early Christmas gift that I've received was the Brave uh, gift set uh, containing the horse. I actually had been looking for this. My brother actually ran across it and was kind enough to pick it up for me. So, so we just considered it a Christmas rather than saying I wouldn't have to uh, pay him back, which I had offered to do, but that was very nice of him. So obviously it does include the two Blu-rays, DVD, and the Angus plush. Yeah, that pony actually looks like he's pretty big there. I'd definitely say the uh, the outside box art is very pretty. Um, I usually just toss these, but this one actually almost has me wanting to hold on to it. But yeah, so let's just pop this open and take a quick look here. And I usually struggle getting these out of here, so hopefully it won't be too bad today. Oops. And my fingers are already stuck. Okay, so there we go. Uh, we have some gloss finish embossing on the actual case. It's actually pretty nice looking here. And we actually have some uh, sparkly stuff going on in the back. So that's always a plus, especially if you're a, a girl, regardless of age. Uh, everyone likes the sparklies. If you're married, you definitely know that. <laughs> And let me see here. So there's the box itself. Not much different from the slip cover, of course, but they rarely deviate, which is good, um, unless it's some crazy limited edition. Um, but taking a look inside, there's our first disc, uh, which is, of course, the Blu ray. And I like how they have this whole. Um, flip thing that's going on here, if I can catch that. There we go. Um, there's the bonus materials for the Blu-ray and the DVD. Um, so all in all, fairly, fairly nice. So there we go, the poor prisoner inside the box. And you can kind of get an idea of how big that guy is, since his back end actually reaches behind the uh, actual Blu-ray there. But let's see if we can get him out of there. So he pretty much looks like a crazy poofy mess, and my backdrop kind of probably doesn't help. He just looks like white pom-poms floating. But if you can see, there's sort of a protective wrap around his neck to keep his long hair from just getting messed up and poofing about, I guess. Uh, his tail is actually long enough. I um, have very bad lighting here, but it's actually been tied into a knot and has been looped around his leg. So that's obviously a very long tail as well. Uh, there's your brave tag once again uh, near the uh, the plush's rear, but um, he actually has some very simple detail, nothing too uh, too fancy going on. But yeah, he's a um, a pretty big guy here, um, roughly about the length of my hand. If you need a scale there, um, but yeah, he's pretty nice. Um, just sort of wish I had better lighting to. Uh, show some of his detail here, but um, we will make do with what we have.